Alright, uh, this is a video on how to screen applications before you start the interview. So, um, in the middle of the summer, there's a couple things you look for. First off, uh, PRs. So, from a friend, that's a PR. Alright, so we're going to start putting them into post, uh, college students. We always look for college students and we look for a GPA. Alright, so this person doesn't know their GPA there. So, I start off by putting them into two columns. Uh, first one is people. Um, so, he would be in the second column because I don't have a GPI. Empire State College, Biology, BS in Biology. I've only been around here for one year. I don't have an age. And they already graduated, so I don't know if this person is somebody I even want to keep for the interview. I have to look. They're probably not, well, they're not a college student, so put them on the side. Anybody whose first name is MD, I always have curiosity about. But I don't have a second page on these people, so I need the... Can you actually tell Sorry to bring me the sign-in sheet? So I need the sign-in sheet. So if I don't know when they're... If you don't know if they're a mailer... All mailers, by the way, guys, should be put in the front unless, like, they're a bad mailer. I mean, like, they're a mailer, they don't go to college, they can't even not dress and all that kind of jazz. Okay. Hey, what's up, buddy? Sure. Throw them in the back there. Okay, so this person right now, I'm going to put him in the second row for now. Okay, good. Now I got that. Okay, so this person is Steven. Oh, he was a PR. Okay, so we'll let him stay. Okay, so he's going to be in the second row. All right, Christopher O'Malley. No student. He's a Craigslister. Okay, so he has high school. He's still in school. I don't know how old he is, though. He graduates in 2010, so okay. So he's also a second row person. MD Akas is also a uh, friend, so he's another PR person. So, again, nobody really has got my attention yet. All right, Daniel here, I don't know if you can read it, is from Kingsborough, pre engineering, 3.85. He's good. I'll put him in the front, good GPA. El Oli is uh, Kingsborough, 3.23 GPA, they're nice, and he's a PR of Mark, so we'll put him in the front row. So, uh, electrical engineering, Jeffrey Liu, you can see he's probably Asian, Liu, Chinese school student instructor, yes, okay, so he's Asian, <laughs> okay. Uh, for some reason, the Asian people always give themselves low ratings as far as communication skills, so I uh, give myself a six as far as communication skills, they always do that, I don't know why, uh, they don't believe in themselves. Uh, probably because he probably doesn't speak English, but maybe he does. But two years in the country, he's going to go in the second row for now. Uh, Masadur Mohammed, 10 years in the country. He's a PR. Uh, Whole Foods business manager, 24 years old. He's a soccer star, apparently. Third row with a soccer star. All right. Um, Canarsi uh, High School acting, high school kid uh, from a friend, Shania. I'm going to put it on the second row. Uh, Keenan Hunt, uh, friend. Now, if there's mailers, guys, you put the mailers. Now, I have, so I have two really good ones right now and a whole bunch of okay ones. New York City Tech, you know, should probably end up in the front row. I'll put it on the front row for now just because I see I don't have that many front row people. Um, New England Conservatory, 3.1 GPA, 20 years old, got a mailer, so front row for Tischler Holmes, Tish, Tischer, Tischer Holmes, and Abita Day came in green pants today, or are you not excited about him, 27, he's probably a PR, which he is, Bishop Newman High School, I don't even know where that is, he go in the third pile. And Johnny Salazar, Borough Park, good area, uh, is referred from a friend. I don't see anything particularly wrong with him. Johnny, okay, so we'll put Johnny in the front row. Okay, so now what we do is we take the front row, the first row people, and, hello Deslin, you're on the video now. Uh, so we got one, two, three, four, five. 
All right, so you can, if you have a large interview, you want to put seven in the front row. If it's a size like this, uh, I'll probably put six. Because if you put seven, one person's like way off to the side. All right, now the first person that you always, the person who's in the front is usually, I usually put a girl there, uh, and uh, or my youngest person. So I'm pretty sure that they won't stand up. Because remember, that first person is in the first corner uh, of the desk. And if they leave, they have to walk through the entire interview to get out. So, um, so you want to put somebody who's young who doesn't have that kind of confidence to do that. Uh, so I'm going to probably put Keenan there. So Keenan will be the first person. All right, and then you want your best three, which would be Tischler here and Daniel and Elole, which looks like a Jewish name. All right, so those three are going to be two, three, and four. Then we got John, Johnny Salazar. You always want to have a guy uh, somewhere to the left. All right, and now uh, one more person gets promoted to the front row. Um, I think we're going to go with Darren here. Oh, no, we'll go Jeffrey Liu. We're going to have a whole front row of guys. It's kind of interesting. Not a lot of women in this interview anyway. So, all right, so Jeffrey Liu, you're promoted front row. All right, now, but he's going to be all the way on the outside on the front row. All right, so now we got one, two, three, four left for the second row. Five six, seven. So we'll put seven in the second row. So we won't have three rows. Uh, the last person is going to be pretty far away. So that's fine. We'll put, we'll put Steven. Okay. The older people I usually put either on the outside or in the back, just in case, because they're more confident in walking out. So I let them walk out. Nobody can see them. Okay. So, oh, and we have, how many more are left? One more. One more than the, this is the last one. Beautiful. Thank you. Okay. This person, Bokar Striden, has been in this area for 10 months and around for a year. He's not exciting either. All right. But now, you only want to have like six and seven. You don't want to go eight in the second row. So, and I don't usually like one person sitting by themselves in the second row. So, I'm going to move back four to the second row. Now, you want your best second row people. Um, to be like three, four, and five, uh, because then they're right, or uh, they'll be right in the middle of the second row. So I have Ishmael, Danya is good. Okay, so this is pretty much set up the way I want. Uh, I'll take Bokor, we'll make him first. So I'll be Bokor, because, uh, you know, Lincoln High School is 17 years old, he hasn't been around for a while in the country, or in the area at least. We'll put MD. I don't even know how you say that. MD, mid, mid, mud, mud. Uh, Ishmael, Daniel. Okay, so now we're going to have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in the second row. That's too many, so I'm going to take um, the le those last three. And uh, this is one, two, three, four, five. Uh, I'll do six, and I'll do a last row of two. So those two can be in the last row there. All right, and that's how you set it up. Okay, so then you put these in the order that you want. So this will be the first person, second person, third person. So when I call them out, I can put them right in order. So I got first row, second row, third row, and I'm ready to go. Also, then what I do is you go on here and uh, circle any of the good people that you're going to accept at the end which would be like Tisher and Daniel. Daniel. I usually just put a little circle. Uh, who's Tisher? Tisher is good. Our receptionists are getting, what is there, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We had 40 people scheduled, so we're getting bad shows. Um, Eli O, I like. All right, those are the three I like for right now. If I like other people during the interview, I'll check them off.